How to make lime putty. The first step in demystifying historic mortar mixtures for repointing limestone walls. In preparation, you will need two five-gallon plastic buckets with lids for every 50-pound bag of lime you wish to turn into putty. For measuring, you will need at least two common metal coffee cans that are six inches tall and six inches in diameter. A smaller size coffee can or large plastic cup is also useful for scooping. You will need a pair of gloves, a spiral paint and mud mixer, an electric hand drill, and a pointed trowel or rubber spatula to scrape the inside of the bucket. A 50-pound bag of lime will fill 18 coffee cans. Each bucket holds eight coffee cans, so the bag of lime will fill two five-gallon buckets completely plus two coffee cans. To begin the process, fill a bucket at least half full with outdoor tap water. Slowly add lime to the water and mix thoroughly with the hand drill. Keep adding lime until it starts to ball up. Add a small amount of water and continue to mix. The putty should be as smooth as mayonnaise or whipped cream cheese. It should hold its shape. Continue to add lime and water alternately until the pre-measured lime is used. Take a trowel or rubber spatula and scrape the sides of the bucket and continue to mix until there are absolutely no lumps remaining. When finished, fill the remaining inch or two of the bucket with more water and cover with the lid. Set the bucket of putty aside and let it age for a month or more. The putty continues to improve with age as long as it is not allowed to freeze or be exposed to air. The advantage of using lime putty is that you get a more accurate amount of lime in proportion to the sand and white Portland cement in your mortar mixture ratio. If you mix all the dry ingredients together first, using the lime as it comes out of the bag, and then add the water to the whole, you will not actually have as much lime in the mixture as you thought because the lime will continue to contract over time. As for costs, a 50-pound bag of lime costs about $15, and each bucket with lid about $7. Keep watching Facebook for the next video in this series when we will demonstrate mixing the lime putty with other ingredients to create the mortar we are using. More helpful videos will follow as we will restore the east wall of the Ledger Building in Cocker City, Kansas. If you would like to donate a bag of lime or a five-gallon bucket for our project, you can visit projectwecan.com. They make your seven or fifteen dollar credit card donation quick, easy, and secure. And while you're at their website, check out the other community projects from across the great state of Kansas.